Right, in this video we're going to look at uh, squaring with brackets and squaring without brackets. So we've got evaluate A is equal to E 5B squared and B is equal to in brackets 5V all squared if V is equal to minus 4. I'm going to show that these are not actually the same thing. So take the first case we've got E is 5V squared. We should know that means that 5V squared means 5 times V times V. When v is minus 4, we get 5 times brackets minus 4 squared. Now, when, when you're substituting numbers in, you should substitute in with brackets. Right, minus 4 squared means minus 4 times minus 4, which is 16. So this becomes 5 times 16, and 5 times 16 is 80. Then we've got e... Part B, E is 5V all squared, because the divided and the V are in brackets. So we need to note that 5V all squared means 5 times V times 5 times V, which is 25V squared. So we can see that 5V squared and 5V all squared are different things. This one is just 5V squared, and this is 25V squared. So when V is equal to minus 4, we got E is equal to 5 times minus 4 in all squared, so in brackets means do first. 5 times minus 4 is minus 20, so we've got minus 20 squared. Notice this in brackets, otherwise when you square it you'll forget the minus sign. If you square minus 20, uh, minus times the minus is positive, and two twos are 4, and you need to add in two zeros, so the final answer is 400. So this has been a video to show you the difference between 5v squared and 5v all squared. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.